Hi, I'm Camellia. I'm 48 years old and I'm on a journey to be fit by 50. Hi guys, so again this week I walked and walked and I walked. Um, I'm quite proud of the steps I, I achieved this week. Um, I purposely made sure I got out. Um, we're lucky we're in summer, so we've got longer days. Got out in the afternoons and got some steps in. I, I'm not walking in the mornings anymore because I find I get too tired at work. So I walk in the afternoons so that I have the evening or night to hopefully recoup and don't um, end up feeling tired all day usually <laughs> um, yeah so lots of walking um, I even got some steps in actual stairs in um, which is great because I haven't done stairs for so long um, I didn't come down them though which is a shame because I love to run down the stairs um, it was just a great week for walking actually we had pretty good weather um, so I was able to get outside I would like to start incorporating other exercises in like some of um, Fine Fitness with Sharon's exercises and Kirsten's Get Quick Fit with Kirsten I'd love to do some of her um, routines as well so hopefully I'll get there um, even if I did them three times a week in the evenings so that would be great uh, this was Friday isn't it beautiful I'm so grateful for the places that I'm allowed to walk that I get to walk um, these beautiful geese white ducks I suppose were like oh what's she gonna do but, oh they were so beautiful so so grateful to be able to <clears throat> explore this these gorgeous parks and share them with everyone so um, yeah lovely way to end a week I must say um, I did wash though I had taken my walking shoes because I had to wipe these down when I got home um, they were covered in dust and the bottoms were covered in this um, because when like, you got to the footpath which is coming up I can't really see in the video but there was just poop everywhere like bird poo everywhere was, um, had to look down just to make sure you didn't stand on anything and then um, later after dinner I actually went for another walk in my neighborhood and I got to see this jewel <laughs> these two so engrossed and attacking each other I'm pretty sure that's what they were doing um, they didn't even care that I was there Look at them go, crazy birds. And here's Derek from Derek's Journey and we are doing his November Steps Challenge. So my son and I turned in 107,627 steps. I did my best stepping yet this week, 52,077 steps and Cullen did 55,550 steps. Now here's um, Sharon and the kick the sugar to the curb while well, I'm just failing. <laughs> Um, here's some takeaways. It was my son's birthday this week, so we went out. There's lots of dessert, lots. And there's some more meringue and pavlova, which is basically straight sugar. But this week I've been trying to add rice. Rice is what I've been trying to add to my diet. Um, I'm just trying to reset, reset because I've been eating so much crap. Yeah, I still have the fruit and I still have the veggies. Here's some seaweed. Um, but here's some takeaways. That was um, Re Burger, Cullen's birthday meal. And here's some rice and kale. And that's a curry and rice and kale. And I bought me a bento box. <laughs> and um, stir fry. It was okay. I'm not going to buy it again though. 90.7. Hi. So this week has been a pretty good week in terms of walking. Like, it's been a really good week in terms of walking. It's the most I've stepped 
in any of these challenges in a week, I think, I believe. I could be wrong about that, but I think so. Well, at least this time anyway. So very happy with the stepping, very um, happy getting out into nature and being able to step. So that's been awesome too. Um, in terms of eating, as you saw, just not there. Big, big fail on the no sugar. Um, and I think it's just one of those things when you 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 know you decide you want to do something and then it just doesn't come together but um so i am as you as i mentioned i'm going to be eating more rice so i'm going to try and reset my palate and my gut and by just having rice so like tonight my meal i had rice with um some chuck wagon corn frozen veggie mix and that was really nice it was just quite nice but then I felt like something sweet so after that I just had a bit more rice with an orange and that was beautiful and I loved it so I am going to be trying to eat rice every day and trying to cut down on any crap because rice is so filling so I'm pleased about that um Oh, and the scales. So I actually thought I'd only maintained. I thought for some reason that I was 90.7 last week. But then I went back and looked at my numbers. Oh, no, and I have to go and grab them because I've forgotten what they were. <coughs> oh, it's dark in here. Where are they? <laughs> but it was um, 91 point something last week. Where are we? Da, da, da. 91 point three okay so it was 91 point three last week and I'd gained 0. 0.6 of a kilo um, so I've actually lost 0. 0.6 of a kilo so I've just gone back so I'm really pleased about that I thought oh yeah cool that's that's great I've maintained but I've actually lost weight this past week so very pleased about that. I'm still trying, hopefully, well, I'm still going to try and get down to 85 before the end of the year. So it's the 21st of November. <laughs> that's what, that's 20, 30 days, 35 days, maybe? 35 days to drop 5Ks. Ooh, I like it. 35 days to drop 5Ks. Can she do it? Can she do it? Okay, yeah, so um maybe. Maybe I can. But yeah, so I have had a pretty good week. Um things in the COVID world are going a bit crazy around here. It's all around us now. Um in our town. Um yeah. I I don't know. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that will mean. Um, there's been no restrictions made on us. Um, I think there's there's not that many in town. I think there's seven seven cases in in my town in my city. Um, but the locations of interest have just expanded. I think there's about twenty places now in my city where um these people have been so i don't know watch the space i guess i don't know should it even be in here i don't know but um yeah so but a bit sucky um yeah i guess we're gonna start wearing masks again um i don't know I have to wait and see what schools are closing, what schools are open, what's, yeah, I don't know what's going on. But um, on a personal note, things are doing pretty well in terms of exercise. And as I mentioned, I'd like to incorporate, I'd like to do some more skipping. I'd like to incorporate that again, even if it's just a minute a day, you know, just something a day would be great. And I'd also like to put, um, do fine fitness with Sharon's workouts especially the five minute ones and quick fit with Kirsten I'd like to I don't know if that's the 
get fit quick with Kirsten. I'd like to do her workouts too, her four for four. Um, they're brilliant. So hopefully, even if I could do one, one of each this week, I'll hold myself to that. I'll do them, I promise. I will do them. Never mind the sugar fail thing. Um, I'm going to start that again with my rice. No processed sugar for me. Can she do it? <laughs> yep. What is that? 30 days to 5Ks? 5Ks for... I don't know. I can't remember it now. But um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. If you didn't enjoy it, please give it a like. <laughs> Let me know that you um, watched it. And let me know if that happens to you when you decide that you want to do something and you do the complete opposite or you just can't do it like me with my complete sugar free fail um yeah let me know in the comments down below and if you haven't already please subscribe or consider subscribing to my channel because it's awesome <laughs> it's awesome to hear from people and um have people from this community just yeah just supporting each other so thank you so much really appreciate you all and have a great week bye